black owned. It's about business, our business, our culture, creating legacies. See us, hear us, support the movement. We are black owned. mystified of black owned reporting we started black owned reporting in the midst of covid but through this adventure we've met a whole lot of people we've been interviewing a whole bunch of black businesses finding out what they're doing where they are how can we find them so i'm here with say of endem say fashion right yes so we're going to start off with you introducing yourself to the people okay my name is say um i'm owner of this business and i'm here to help my people you know to do what they need to do to build their business, you know, better, like, you know, never before. So how long has Endem Safe Fashion been around? Safe Fashion has been around for a while, because, you know, my first business, you know, I opened it since, you know, 1988. 1988? Yeah, um, then, um, to present this is all i'm doing for for living yeah. mm. so fashion tell me a little bit about how you got well you found your love of fashion okay my love of fashion i love my love of fashion you know back home because you know uh, when i was a child i used to go to store with my uncle he's the one who teach me how to be become tailor oh wow he teach me how to sew yeah so you do well do you do everything on site do you make all the beautiful fashions on site no, uh, I make all this, you know, before fashion on my own, you know, and um, you call custom made. You come with your design, then I help you to make it happen. So what kind of, because I know you have church robes, you have dresses, like what else do you offer? You know, I almost, you know, owe like everything like you see like people wear, mm -hmm. you know, if you show me what you want, I will help you make it happen. I make suit. I make children clothes, I make, you know, everything. Long as I see what you need and what you're looking for, mm -hmm. I'm so excited to help you to get what you want. That's why I call this like a custom made. You can come with your own design and I'll help you make it. Oh wow. Yes. So I know in an earlier conversation that we spoke, mm -hmm. you said that you're from West Africa. Yes. So a lot of your designs, are they from, are they West African based? No, my old design is basically come from all, you know, all Africa, over the world. all over the world, yeah. <laughs> Africa, you know, Europe. Like, if you if you come with your, you know, like regular suit, mm -hmm. like European suit, I can make it. If you come with your own design, I can make it. I'm here just to make people close. Mm -hmm. Anything you have, you bring it here. I help you make it. Mm -hmm. You know, not just for Africa, not just for European. I make it for the universal clothes. Mm -hmm. Long as I see what you what you want, I help you make it happen. Okay, so what if I'm like, I need to get something altered. Do mm -hmm. you also offer off alteration also, services? Yes, I also do alteration. Like if you bring your clothes, it's very wide or it's too small, you know, I help you, you know, to adjust it. Oh, so you're, you're doing a bunch. You're, you're making the clothes, you're adjusting them, you're making them custom, you're making sure that, you know, I can, I can get you fitted. Yes, yes, <laughs> yes, 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 yes. So how long has this specific business been around? Okay, this one, I just opened it, you know, not long ago, but now, um, six to five months on this place so during corona you were here i get this place when everything was tough <laughs> then i make this risk to open this business you know mm -hmm. then i know this is gonna be like forever i know soon it's gonna go away mm -hmm. then when it's gonna go away i'm gonna be even happier mm -hmm. but now i know it's, it's, it's tough now but i hope mm -hmm. then i have a feeling that you know everything is gonna get back to normal I have a feeling as well. Yeah, We're all, that's I, the got, I got this place when everything, you know, like was down. Then I was passing one day, I see this place. I'm like, you know what? Let me stop and take this number and call. Mm -hmm. Then when I call, everything was calm. Like, it just kind of fell into place. Exactly. Then God blessed me with this place. Then I'm happy with it. Because when people, you know, come in and they like what they see, that's bring me happy. Make me rich, make me feel like you know <laughs> I am the you know, <laughs> you're, you're in it exactly. It brings yeah. you a good feeling, exactly. It's making you feel not just the money. Sometimes, when people give you some compliment about what you're doing, mm -hmm. it's make my heart you know feel even like more you know better, fills you with joy, exactly. You know, yeah. 
So now, let's say I want to get an op well, I want to get an alteration, or I want to get a design done. Mm -hmm. How would I find you? How would I connect? Okay, now if you uh, if you want to find me, I have my business card, and I also have my um uh, my I'm trying to build my website, mm -hmm. but it's not completely ready, mm -hmm. you know. But I hope that soon it's going to be ready, and people can find me from the website. But for now, I'm only be like. You know instagram mm -hmm. you know by typing like you know and um say fashion so and them say fashion is the instagram it's, handle. It's, no basically and you know say fashion is the is the instagram mm -hmm. but and um say fashion is the name of the business mm -hmm. but if you want to find me on the instagram just say say fashion then you're going to see me there then i have i post my you know own clothes and i'm here to help people i see you're wearing one of your fashions yes so this brings me to a shameless plug because I like to speak things into existence. Exactly, yeah. So shameless plug time. Mm -hmm. Shameless plugs are basically the what next or what can we expect from you. Mm -hmm. I'm hoping for a fashion show. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. what's next? What do you want to shamelessly plug up? Okay, uh, you see like just how we said, I wear my own fashion. And this is what I make, you know, this one is made from here. Then I'm the one who make it. Then uh, I'm ready to do a fashion show. You know, if I have like good people to help me to build, you know, mm -hmm. to do it together, I'm ready for it because I'm trying to expose my business, mm -hmm. like, you know. As well as your fashion. Well as my fashion. Mm -hmm. And I'm here to help my community. I, at the same time, I want my community also to help me. Mm -hmm. Just like people like you guys, you guys helping, you know, then I'm here also to help. And if we're helping together, we can even go a little further. This is what we need mm -hmm. as a community, as a family. Mm -hmm. You know, this is what we need. We have to be together. Mm -hmm. Then everything you do on, you know, together is gonna get strong and as strong. But alone is weak. One hand can make noise, mm -hmm. but two hand it makes a lot of noise. Make some noise. <laughs> Another hand make even more <laughs> noise. But mm -hmm. we need to put our hand together. And hope that you know what we're looking for we're gonna be even you know further than what we're looking for then this is what we need to do we need to stand and do this this is what we need to do we have to trust you know ourselves mm -hmm. don't try to depend on nobody be your own stuff if people come to help you there if people don't come to help you out there mm -hmm. but help everybody help. so you're here to help I'm here to help then I'm here also to take help, mm -hmm. but sometimes when you, whatever you give, you get back. If you don't give nothing, you're never going to get nothing back. So I know in an earlier conversation, you mentioned a really juicy tidbit for Shameless Plug. So I know you used to design for someone famous, so I need you to drop it. I need the Shameless Plug. Shamelessly plug it up. <laughs> you know, like when I told you back in the day, like, you know, 1999, 2000, um, I used to um, make, you know, this famous uh, call uh, Bambri. You know, I used to make his clothes. I don't even know like that was him, <laughs> because one of my customer, you know, I make them clothes and they like it, mm -hmm. and they recommend to him to come and see me. Then when I make his clothes, he was excited. Mm -hmm. He also loved it, you know. Then he keep coming to my store. Then one day I take a picture, you know, me and him. Then I put it on my book. That's the time I know who, who person like I'm dealing with. When customer come and try to look, you know, look, look some style, and when they see his picture, they what what say? This is why you expensive, you know. <laughs> now he's going for 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 these people. I'm like what? And they, they they point him like this guy. You know this guy? I'm like no, I don't know. They say no, you're joking. You know him, and they have to show me, you know, the movie that I was talking about with his roots. Mm -hmm. And that's the time I know like I'm dealing with a famous. Wow. But I was like thinking about because anytime he came to my shop, you know, he bring like a beautiful car and he has some people. I'm like, this guy is rich. I didn't know like he was famous. <laughs> you didn't know who he was. You're like, exactly, you know, I know he's coming to me. Yeah. To bring me the business. Hey, but, but I don't know who he is. <laughs> you know, you know. It's funny how life works. I know. Life is, is work funny. But whatever you do in life, just make sure you do it well. When you do it well, you, you, you keep seeing people more and more. Because mm -hmm. sometimes it's about money, but sometimes it's about sell your business by doing what you love to do. Mm -hmm. Then when people give you the order, make sure you do it right. Mm -hmm. 
make them feel happy before even they leave here. And when they wear it outside, people see it and they will ask questions. Who made these clothes? And, then and say, that's how say. you get business. <laughs> that's how you get business, you know? This business, I, you know, I'm happy I'm, I'm here because this is what I love to do. I cannot do nothing but what I'm doing now. Because exactly. this is me. This is what I know for living. What I do for living also. You know? But, you know, the, the story I used to tell you before, you know, on Fulton and Franklin, and uh, we lose the list because they sold the building, mm -hmm. you know? And I have to go to work a regular basic job. So those are, those are some, that's a beautiful final thought. You know, you take a risk and you know, you are happy doing what you love. Exactly. So now I'm, I'm going to have you plug up again. If I want to connect or I want to find you, where can I find you? Okay. For now, you can only find me, you know, on the Instagram, what is safe fashion for now, but I'm trying to do my own website, but it's not ready yet. And um, otherwise, the business card. So I'm really looking forward to when you're hosting your fashion show because I'm hoping you're gonna come back and let me cover it. Definitely. <laughs> if I if I have anybody like, you know, try to be a fashion show, you know, what is mm -hmm. I feel comfortable with that, you know, I will contact you guys and we can mm -hmm. do it together. So what is the address? Like where are we? Okay, the address we are now is fifteen zero seven Saint John Place. So 1507 St. John's, John's Place. St. John's Place in Brooklyn, mm -hmm. New York. The zip code is 11213. Okay. So you guys are already here. If you guys like these videos, make sure you like, you comment, and you subscribe. So thank you so much for letting me interview you and find out all about your fashions. So this is Vista Fine signing off. I'm shining. 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 I'm shining.